Alright guys, what is up? It's Kel and welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to have for you guys another squad builder. This is going to be a 30k Barley's Premier League sweat team. Now you guys will be looking at this and thinking, well, three at the back, you're going to get anal raped every game. But in fact, you're not. Just because of these defenders. So anyway, let's start into the goalkeeper. We'll have probably the most overpowered keeper in the league is Julio Cesar. 6 foot 1 and just all around good stats. 84 diving, 84 reflexes, 80 handling, 82 positioning. This guy's just an absolute tank in goals. He's unbeatable. I mean, uh, as you can see, I've played like 5 games with this team and I've not lost one game, so that's pretty good. Uh, now on to, sorry, yeah, on to the right centre back where we have Kabul. So you guys will know about this. This man, he's an absolute bear in this game. 83 heading, 80 defending, and 77 pace. And the fact he's six foot three. Holy fuck, this guy is overpowered. But oh well, look at those stats. Just great. Bought him for 1,700 coins. Absolute bargain. Now in the right centre back we have Yanga Mabiwa. Right, you guys were expecting David Leeds for this one, but I don't use him in this team just for the fact that he's in another squad of mine, so obviously fitness reasons. This guy, 76 pace, 81 defence, 79 heading, and he's also 6 foot, so he's not exactly small. He's actually, I think he's quite strong as well, he's got about 83, 84 strength, so his shoulders quite a lot of guys off the ball, and he's got the pace to keep up with them. As you can see, he's actually scored a goal for me, I think that was from a corner. Now to finish off the defence, we have the one and only Thomas Vermaelen. You guys maybe not expecting this because it's a 70 pace, but I mean just look at that, 83 defending, 85 heading. What the fuck man, this guy is out of this world and he's just an absolute bear in the defence. Now as you can see, we're having four wingers in this team, this is what makes it so sweaty. So let's start off with the centre mids, where we have Jack Wilshire and Ramirez. So using these guys, just the fact, Jack Wilshire is quite defensive and so is Ramirez. So we've got it so is it potentially five guys pushing forward and then five guys sitting back. But although the centre mids do have the ability to go forward and score, I mean I've scored I think I've scored with yeah, I scored with Ramirez and not yet with Jack Wilshire. I think Ramirez was a long shot, it was pretty nice. I mean they've they've not exactly got the best shooting stats but their passing stats are pretty good in the midfield. So, on the left mid we have Ashley Young, you guys should have really seen this one coming, just, I mean, the pace, he's also got 4 star skills, so it's not exactly bad, he's got 3 star weak foot, but I picked, put him there instead of the wingers, because he has medium medium uh, work rate, so he does get back a bit, and on the right mid we have Valencia, this guy, he has got a medium uh, defensive work rate, so that's why I play him there, he's also got a high attack and work rate, so he does uh, run out of energy quite a lot. But that's the reason why these two guys are here, they've got medium defensive work rates to work back. So, if we push up on the left wing, we have Jovino, this guy has a, a, I think it's medium high work rate. So he does, uh, he doesn't really get back much I don't think. I think it's low, work, low defensive work rate he has, so he always stays up the pitch. And high uh, attack and work rate, 4 star skills, great, and right foot. He's got 88 pace, 87 dribbling. That 69 shooting also seems a bit, uh, like, underpowered. And now on the right wing we have Arn Lennon. The only reason this guy's here, yeah again, work rates. I mean, I was going to have Valencia right wing, but Arn Lennon's work rates are just, they suit this position perfectly. High time work, high attack and work rate and low defensive work rate. So he's always staying up the pitch. I mean, he's 5'5", five five, but he's got 92 pace, so you can't really help that. 70 passing, 84 dribbling as well, and 4 star skills, as well as 3 star weak foot. So it's quite good for cutting down the wing. Uh, just skimmed out by defenders and played it into our main man here, who is Remy. Right, you guys, this guy is an absolute tank. 92 pace, 76 shooting, feels so much better. 71 passing, 78 dribbling and 84 heading. This guy is just a complete striker. As you can see there, he scored 9 goals in 5 games. Although, uh, after 2 games, he had scored 7 goals for me. That is, he scored 5 goals in his first game. That is fucking brilliant. Now this is just the sweatiest team I think I can make, except the subs, you'll see them in, an, in my next squad builder. But anyway, let's get into the goals guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you have some uh, fun sweating out with this team. I'm just going to get my towel and sweatbands, I'll see you guys later.